All right, now you know how we start a new week. Anybody still have what they had last Sunday? Huh. Don't mean nothing to you, huh? Anybody still have what they had last Sunday? Praise him, Daniel. Don't wait on nobody. Still got your kids? Still got good sense? All right, that's at a premium. Uh, anybody want to thank God that Putin ain't bombed your old Ukraine? <laughs> How about eyesight? How about hearing? How about a sense of smell? How about taste buds? How about your equilibrium? Nobody's house caught on fire? Come on now. Outer court. Praise him for what he's done. House card. Praise him for what you can see. Everything have breath. That's outer court. Natural sunlight. All right. Come on here because we about to go deep. Natural sunlight. Huh? Huh? That's a praiser. You praising God for action. Mm. Now we're going to go to the other folk. Those are worshipers. Worship God for his ways. Worship his stuff. You, you thankful. You praising him for you can't even see. Worshiper. Only light you have is the light down in your soul. That's a worshiper. The ways of God. You don't have to see it. The Lord is my light and my salvation. The worshiper, the ways of God. Dark in your finances. Dark, dark, dark. But you see it. Who in here can see in the dark? Huh? Because you trust God. Huh? You have peace with God. Peace with God can only come by faith. Peace of God is prayer. Who in here got peace with God? Faith. You see what those in the outer light can't see. Outer court. All right. There is a difference. The levels to this thing. Mm. That's for everyone who Satan said, what's the use? Look at your job. Look at your account. Look at your marriage. Look at your health. Look at, man, worshipers don't care. Amen. They are out even though they can't see their way out. Come on, worshiper. Let the praiser know there's a difference between you and me. We might sit in the same row, but we ain't on the same level. <laughs> That's a worshiper. All right. You had your chance. Huh? Somebody is worshiping God for being framed. You made up your mind, you ain't going to have no nervous breakdown for something that ain't framed. Amen. All right. You looking for any more excitement? I can't do the splits. I can't spin like they do, huh? If I could sing like Coca, my beer would be in the car, but I'd be drinking that mic. Hanging on to no fun hour. Come here, Sonia. Sonia got a situation coming up. Huh. 
It's only one of the hardest workers in this church. Come here, Keith and Lisa. Keith always praying for folk. Sincerely, he a real man of God. Not nobody talking about being a man of God. I'm going to train you. Lisa, because something crept up on her. Like something crept up on Sonia. See that right there, that under her neck? That crept up on her. She got to get a biopsy and surgery. Put your hand right there on that neck. All right. Notice what I'm doing. It's a young woman. Huh? See, she can put her hand where I can't put my hand. That's just, just training, all right? That just crept up. Whatever it is, it's too late. She already put in much work here. Man, 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 we talking about hundreds of thousands of dollars. She's so trusted, she put her tithes and offering in the bank. Amen. Uh, man, like a clock. She trusted. And something crept up on her. Like Lisa's blockage crept up on her. Huh? Now, we, we not only praying for this, we praying for a Keith in her life. Come on, man. I'm going to do a couple of things. Hey, Amen. You got to have a man of God. You can't have no situation and somebody looking at the insurance papers. That's happened in this church, and I ran them out. All right, Keith. Put your hand on your wife, your shoulder. Man, look at that transfer. Sonia going to come out. Yeah. Amen. Everybody stand. Ain't you, amen. Ain't you, you sitting there, sitting there. Some creep crept up on you. We that man. This one already got work in. And it crept up on her. See, when I was telling you to thank God, some of y'all casual because you ain't ready for that to creep up on you. It crept up on her. But the work already done. That's how healthy it is. You look at it, it shows up. Go ahead, man of God. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you, Father God, for another day of life, Father God, for another cup of mercy and grace, Father God. Lord, we thank you for your goodness and your loving kindness towards us, Father God. Your thoughts towards us, Father God, being thoughts of peace and not thoughts of evil. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we come before you, Father God, on behalf of this faithful woman of God, Lord Jesus, this soldier, Father God, this warrior, Father God, this woman, Father God, that stands for righteousness, Lord, this fighter. She is a great woman, Father God. We bring her before you, Father God, in prayer, Father God. Ask that you touch her, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Matter of fact, we're just going to speak life over her right now in the name of Jesus, Father. We're going to speak to it, Father God, this situation. with Whatever it is that's afflicting her throat, Father God, we speak to that affliction until it be gone in the name of Jesus. You have no place in this body. In the, this is a woman of God. Hallelujah. Touch, Father God, in the name of Jesus, by your power, Father God. Heal, Father God. Father, your word declares that by your stripes we are healed. Not that we will be healed, Father God, but that we are healed, Father God. And we speak healing over her in the name of Jesus, Father God, because she still has work to do, Father God. Father God, she has been a soldier in this sanctuary, Father God, a leader in this sanctuary, a worker, Father God. And Father, you declare that the prayers of the righteous avail it much, Father God. So we come together, Father God, in unity, Father God, on her behalf, Father God, lifting her up in the name of Jesus, speaking healing over her, Father. We plead the blood over her situation, Father God. And we thank you, Father God, because we know it's done, Father God. We know, Father God, that you have a work for her to do, and she's doing it, Father God. So we speak, Father God, healing in the name of Jesus, Father. We speak life in the name of Jesus, Lord. We speak health, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Father, we speak to her man of God, Father, that somewhere in the earth, Father God, 
This woman, Father God, you declare, Father God, that a man who finds a wife finds a good thing, Father God. Let that man find this wife, Father. She is a wife, Father. She is a faithful woman, Father God. And we thank you, Lord, for her, Father God. Bless, Father God. Touch, Lord God. Heal in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord. We thank you. Her grandbabies need her, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father. The saints of God need her, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God. See, Father God, belongs to you, Father God. And we speak healing over her, Father. We plead the blood of Jesus over her, Father God. Thank you for this great woman of God, Father. And, Father, we count it done in the mighty name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We pray and give thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on, praise God. Put your hand together. Yes. Praise him, Sonia. Whoa, praise him. That's real Holy Ghost there, folks. If something's going to creep up on you, I already have your work in. If something's going to creep up on you, I already have your resume. Ask pure Holy Ghost. That's what a servant can do. Not, Lord, touch me so I can serve. I've already served. Where are you going to find another one? It'll take God 50 more years to get another Sonia. Come on. Lord, we thank you. Woo. It's good to have the work in already. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for Keith and Lisa. Amen. You don't want to be a Lisa without a Keith. They were instrumental in reconnecting her with her daughter so she could see her grandchildren. How about that? Amen. Isn't that beautiful? Two or three. Y'all hear what I say? It's good to have to work in. Coach, I ain't got to pray. Well, touch her body so she can do work for you. No. That one to put in the work. Amen. All right, you can be seated. We, we, we got things to talk about. We got things to talk about. We, we still on this faith of Abraham man man that church is going to need to take his name out of their mouth there's so much more to him right. okay yeah. and we'll see it uh, we'll go to Job later but get Hebrews chapter 11 I turn right to it you know, you can't have faith and have disobedience. That's right. <laughs> Abraham did one thing right, Kobe. He believed God. We always talk about Peter messing up because he tried to cut a man's head off and cuss somebody out. Mm -hmm. Come on, all you cussers, say amen. Amen. But Abraham, the man of God is to say Abraham wasn't right either. He, we talk about Peter, but we give Abraham a break. Mm -hmm. Abraham had some disobedience. Yep. He took cut and lot. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody got cut and lot. Uh -huh. That thing you left on your dresser that's missing cut and lot took it. 
Okay, there's a book I won't have in my house. Huh? To the shelter they go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm stealing. Huh? Took cutting a lot with him. Cutting a lot got rich because of him. Look, cutting a lot got beside him. So some people can't stand prosperity. If they get a brick on their house, living in the ridges, you don't know them no more. Okay. Don't get them a car where ain't no lights on inside on the dash. <laughs> they quit speaking to folk. Hmm? Only reason why some of y'all got on is because you went to the gas pump and that 28, that needle barely moved. Now you're back to being friendly. <laughs> See, cutting lot, cutting lot, he had to separate from cutting lot. Did cutting cut lot get himself in trouble? He sure, sure did. Sure when they got, when someone got important. Yes, he did. Huh? When someone got important. Mm-hmm. And then Abraham's wife was so fine. Huh? There's a song that says, you want to be happy for the rest of your life, make an ugly woman your wife. Uh, Abraham didn't write that song. That's a song. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is a song. It said, want to be happy for the rest of your life. Uh, that is a song. There it is, man. Y'all young. That way I mean, keep it just a little boozy. Everything you listen to is little. Uh, but Abraham's wife was so fine, he lied. And you know lying ran in the family because didn't Isaac lie too? Yes, sure did. Come on now. How many of y'all know lying run in your family? Yes, it does. See, you just lie, right? See? <laughs> <laughs> so he's a liar too. Mm-hmm. And yet God called the accountant in heaven and gave him credit because he believed God. Yes, sir. If we to see the Abraham, God going to give us credit for one thing. Amen, huh? Because we believe him. So look at the obedience in going where God told him to go. If it was 100% obedience, we'd have to go ahead and shut the church down, right? Right. We remember what we're obedient in. How many of y'all remember some disobedience? So so you're still lying, all right? Uh, Hebrews 11. Can't get that line out of you. I ain't got time. Verse chapter 11 of Hebrews. Verse 1. Then we're going to go. We got to go back to that frame. Yes. Beautiful. Huh? We got to go back to that f- being framed. Yes. All right? Now, faith is the substance of things hoped for. Things hoped for. Read. The evidence of things not seen. Not seen. So we, we, we. Made a difference between the worshiper and the praiser. Yes. Trey, the praiser, which everybody can do, everything that had breath, praise the Lord, is a person, write this down, who praises God for his acts. Strictly outer court, sunlight, everybody can see it. Mm, new car, new home, new clothes, new French on your toes. All right, everybody can see it. All right. <laughs> you got deep clawed. <laughs> got your fingernails right. Huh? Huh? Everybody can see it. Mm. Praiser. It, it's so, uh, man, God says the pediatrics of praise. It's so common. God said, you don't even have to be saved to praise God. <laughs> Everything, you, you just have to have breath. To praise him for his acts, what he's done. Uh, but hey, it's important. Come in his court with, Amen. Don't 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 come to church with a bad attitude. Stay home. Let the bed bugs bite you. All right. That's praise. Yes, sir. Worship. The worshiper. That's inner court. That's divine light. Yes. That's praising God for what you can't see. Amen. Worshiping God. Not pray. Worship is the ways of God. No. Mm. You wake up and worship. Yes. You can wake and praise God because you in the house, you in the car, you whatever. Huh? But you're a worshiper. You getting up, giving God some worship over something you can't even see. But you see it in the spirit. It's in the dark. Come on, That's a worshiper. The ways. That's good. The praiser is acts. The worshiper is ways. 
talking about faith, okay? Uh, faith don't come by singing. If it did, Coco wouldn't have to come to church. She just get up and hit a note and go on back to bed. <laughs> but faith come, comes by hearing. Uh, that frame that we're talking about, that you're boxed in, that frame is the word of God. So you're not supposed to have a nervous breakdown. Uh, yeah, it's no way in the world you can have a nervous breakdown speaking a word every day. I don't care if you agree or not. People losing their mind. Yes, no word. Huh? Yes, no word. Yes, sir. God is not the God of a nervous breakdown. No. Yeah, you can be overwhelmed. That's what the word says. See, people, hey, amen, don't think, uh, man, just like Sonia, Working hard in the church, man, something don't bother nobody. But something popped up in her body. Right. Hmm? So you put a word on it. That's it. Got to. Speak it. Yes, sir. Because worrying will aggravate whatever's wrong. Come on. Come on. Everything. And you know what's so beautiful? To be able to lay hands, and let's say whatever happened, to lay hands on herself. That's it. Don't a handful. Oh, lay hands on yourself. Yes, I've done it. You don't just have to talk, but you have to walk to lay hands on yourself. That's it's right. good to have a Keith and Lisa and a May Lee and a Path to pray for you. But somebody here got a life where if I didn't, amen. If my if Hallelujah. That's a whole nother level. That's about living. Yes. Okay. Faith come by hearing. We'll get to that later. All right, read. For by the elders obtain a good report. So what about the Reverend Dr. Apostles? I don't think so. I'm so sick of these people. Yes. Mailing off two box tops and claiming something. All right, y'all ain't sick of them. All right, verse 3. Through faith, we understand that the worlds were framed. The, the worlds were what? Framed. Framed worlds. So if the worlds were, your world should be framed. By the by the what? The by, singing. By the word of God. So you mean you mean the word of God can frame the worlds? Yes, Lord. <laughs> you in another world. That's a so far, Brittany. So that things which are seen were not made of things which do appear. Read. So that things which are seen were not made of things which are, do appear by faith, Abel offered unto God a more excellent sacrifice than Cain. Cain, who you mad at? Mm-hmm. You had plenty of time. Even though you did it wrong, you had plenty of time to do it right. Spirit of Cain still alive, y'all. Yes, sir. The people mad at you. Huh? What's so important about Sonia? Her sacrifice, her hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of without without oversight. Thank you, Jesus. See, some folks can't do nothing unless you're watching them. Now I done walked in on Betty, her, Elijah, yeah. Michelle, yeah. Tim. They didn't even know I was coming. You walk in, you We ain't talking about they round taking the vacuum and beating the chairs up, but singing. They didn't know I was here. I walked in, man, many times. Huh? Because I got a little cat in me. I just walk in. You don't even know I'm here. <laughs> right. I just, I don't bother them. Go about their business. Okay? They offer better sacrifice. Hmm? Mm-hmm. While you looking at somebody cross-eyed in your row, you don't, it, don't look at them. Look at yourself. <laughs> they say... <laughs> If you cross that, I would make it fun of just a little figure of speech. All right. Huh? By which he obtained witness that he was what? That he was righteous. Read. God testifying of his gifts. Who testified? God. <laughs> Big God. difference. Yes, Lord. Uh, man, if God testify of your. Of his gifts. Woo. Hi. Of your gifts. Yes, Lord. See, y'all, man, y'all so sleepy. Oh, if no. God testified. Yes, We don't care about no biopsy, whatever. If God testify yes. of her gift. Yes. 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 
And look, it's so powerful. And by it, he being dead, yet yes. speaking. That blood. Yes, Lord. Huh? Remember Amber Harris funeral? Yes. That was packed out and the TV stations out. Look, John, that's one of those deals. I try to put something together. Man, that's one of those. Remember that little switch I told you about on Wednesday? That, that little switch that went off like, you know what, God? Either you with me or you not. I put all that stuff down. Yes. Yeah. That's what made Snook. Snook in jail again, ain't he? Yeah, all right, all right. He got a little home. Uh, Snook wrote me talking about, Barlow, I knew you the realest. You know, he talked hood talk. So-and-so I ever knew. He said, but, uh, no, I mean, it's respectful. That's just, that's, oh, you say the same thing. You in the church. <laughs> you, come on now. Come on now. <laughs> he said, but I want to see how you're going to act under all those lights. Uh. He said, Barlow, you're going to make me cry. Huh? Yeah, you come with it. Come with it. Okay. And that 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 Amber Harris. Yes. Ooh. Shining. Patty Claus's daddy was here, right? TV can wake up. I mean, ain't nothing like wake up seeing the uh, news people under your marquee. Y'all either with me or you're not. Right. They had remember. They were looking at somebody in the family, looking for a profile reaction. I remember the daughter, her sister, remember they had a picture of her? Right. Her sister stood right here, and I said something. Her sister didn't. She just looked at me like, you have no idea. So that's the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, Lord. That's why I tried to tell this little reverend years ago, talking about uh, he forgot his message on his word process. I let you know how long the word process. I said, man, you got to come from here. Right. He's still trying to use a word processor. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just anyway. So God, like I shut all my notes down. I, here I am. Man, it's hard to explain yeah, to y'all what that feel like. Come on, Bishop. <laughs> God, Woo, man. But but here, here's a part that showed up. I told her mama. That blood of that innocent girl, yes, it going to cry out. Yes. It wasn't long after that. Right. Come on now. Somebody found a backpack in some trash yes. with some fingerprints on it. Are you still on death row, that man? Did he die? Yeah, he's still on death row. Huh? Uh, yeah, yeah. Cause when he die, everybody going to cut the lights off. Let, let, let all the energy flow through his body. Uh, see, you take it for granted, your child going to come home from school. Right. 12 years old. Are you, are you, let me get graphic with it. He took and crushed her with a, what, she had a big hole in her head. Yes, she did. When they found her in Humble Park, she had a big hole in her head where he took a stone and crushed her skull. See, sometimes you can be in la-la land because you think that can't happen. I want everybody who still got their child, amen, from last Sunday. Oh, you do know they kidnap children. They snatch them. This is a snatch area. See, you want to sit here and be fade out. You know they snatch kids in Nebraska, Linda? Do they snatch them? All ages? They ain't got enough milk cartons. Okay, all right. I understand. Well, let me, you know what? I thank God for my Zoe. I thank God. God say the same 12 years. I thank God. I made my little guy, CJ, smile this week. Thank God for my baby. I thank God for the, 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 the grandson in Shay's stomach, huh? I can't afford, we might go to the same church, but I can't afford to have your attitude. I can't afford it. Too expensive. Too expensive. They snatch kids in this. That one boy around Benson, they ain't found him yet. That was 20 some years ago. Look at the autistic child. Ain't nobody found him. Be in La La Land, then when it happened, oh man, 
things happening around you. you Snatch her off the bus. She put lipstick on. Snatch her off the bus. Wow. Some sick man. Yes. Who who had. Two women in town. He screwed their daughters. Sure did. Yeah. Yeah. Their daughters. Right. They got babies by this man. Yep. Sure did. And he on death row. Two. You want to know why I go off so you don't bring a spirit. You think your butt's so magical. There's a spirit that ain't satisfied just with your butt. Uh, you better thank God for our Simona. Her Cameron, amen. Her Cameron. Shana, and then nobody and your Courtney you know what's in the family that never took that's God somebody say God I thank you they don't know come here Cameron my gorgeous Cameron can walk down the aisle Huh? She been this way since what? Ten, nine? Because of her mama. Her mama protected her. Oh, it means something. Praise him some more. Her mama. Let me escort you back for somebody. All right, back to the lair where you go. Have a seat. <laughs> got, got, got to put that back in the lair way. Huh? <laughs> May leave your mind too quick. Put that back in the lair way. All right. A Amber Harris, he's not sure. Crush your skull, big hole in her head. And I said the blood, her innocent blood, going to cry out. Yes, he did. That blood cried out, too. Amen. That backpack. Mm -hmm. Another, another, and then he told another criminal, man. But I wonder what happened to him that made him molest, too. Y'all play so many church games. Family secret. Huh? I can't tell mama's her boyfriend. I can't tell mama's her brother, my uncle, because I'll get put out. Right. Mm, okay, I'll get off of that. Most times they do. Mm -hmm. Innocent blood. Yes. May leave without the name. That, that man of God who went all the way left. It, man, I had a whole new take on him. He's off, but why is he off? Because he don't want their God That's in his right. mind. That's what, man, yeah. man, he's off, off. But he don't want their God. Right. No. I don't want the God you was jumping up and down and laying out while men were molesting him. I don't want that God. Man. And his mind couldn't say, no, that's on them, but there's a true and living God. Yeah. Because he has eloquence and talent, and that's what they saw. Right. Care what you say about twenty two sixteen military? You protected in here, that's and right. uh, didn't nobody rape no Daydreon. That's right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Get out there and find out what's out there. Come on now. Come on. Some of those houses you call churches aren't even houses of God. They trap houses. Come on, bitch. Teach that. Teach. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
with some drugged up pedophiles. Right in church. That's it. Your trap houses. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hmm? And that woman sat here, man, a man. It was deep. It was deep. Yeah, it was. And they found that man. And he's doing life. Okay? Blood cries out. Yes, Lord. Ooh. I feel like praying for something. The lady who. They're going to sentence the man. They ain't found her body yet. The one where the man used to feed the kids stuff so they wouldn't hear him beating her with a shoe. Right, right. right. Yeah. And the child had enough sense to put it in her tongue and spit it. Huh? Man, y'all ought to thank God. Right. I want somebody by themselves to thank God right now. <laughs> by themselves. Worst thing in the world, uh, your child got to wait till they grown. Then they tell you. About that spirit you brought in their life. Uh, you know what? Hey. I bet ain't nobody going to dog Simone out. I bet it ain't happening. Huh? <laughs> Dad said there's going to be two people in prison. Him, Shaquille. Might will be a family affair. Huh? She's sitting here just as gorgeous and she don't even know she protected but thank God. Hey. <sighs> if you look at J.C. Ron. Don't even look at her. Man, all right. And this poor child got picked off on the bus. Yes, she did. Who was the child at North High School that? Kenyatta yes, Bush. I was there. And Kenyatta. Yes. Yeah. That racist got off because the other boy killed himself. He got off, but he didn't get off. Oh, y'all play too much. Something God say, I'm going to handle. I'm going to handle. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I'm going to scare somebody because y'all y'all all fully yourself. Must have had a couple of cheeseburgers last night. I'm, I'm going to show y'all something real quick just because, you know what? Because some of you, I remember at Wednesday, I kind of, I didn't mean to, but I had to handle it. Uh, I didn't mean to pick the scab off of your scar. All right, but I had to handle it, let yes. you know how good God is. And my point was, folk will boo up and don't even know how deep people's scars are. That's right. Man, right. it was uncomfortable, and I feel bad. And I remember my call doing I'm like, man, uh, uh. he said, no, 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 uh-uh. Because uh -uh. you bull people, don't even know that scar deep. That's right. That old Rod Stewart saw the first cut is the deepest. Right. But you don't know how deep the scar is till you get with them. That's right. So I had to, had to, had to peel it out. But, but, but just in case you, you think someone. Has gotten away with something. I read this every morning. Bring it. Because uh, somebody, somebody here is deep. Uh, Psalm 21, uh, uh, 21, 21, 21. Remember that number, 21. Come on, people. People, mm -hmm. I took y'all by our place. 21's in that. 21, 21. 21 is a number of restoration. Mm -hmm. I learned that by listening to somebody who's deeper than me. Okay? Uh, Psalm 21, just in case. Look at verse 8. I'm just, this is a sidebar, but it's not. We're going to get right back to Abraham. Thy hand shall find out all thy enemies. Thy right hand shall find out those that hate thee. Mm -hmm. Thy right hand. Thou shalt make them as a fiery oven, fiery oven at the time of thy anger. The Lord shall swallow them up in his wrath, and the fire shall devour them. Hmm. Their fruit shall thou destroy from the earth. And their seed from among the children of men. Okay, verse 11. For they intended evil against thee. Mm -hmm. They imagined a mischievous device mm -hmm. which they are not able to perform. Ooh, 
Hang on to that word perform. We're going to yeah. go back to that word later on. To perform. Not able to perform. Yes. Here's a bad scripture. I'm going to read it real slow. Therefore, which means that's what's coming up next. After they fail in their performance. Shall thou make them turn their back. When thou shalt make ready thy arrows upon thy strings. Watch this now. They got to get their back turned. They can't see this coming. You crying about somebody, they got away. No, God. Remember, it's all happened on the same day. They back don't get turned. Yeah. Read it, May Lee. That they, st- watch this. Therefore shall thou make them turn their back. Turn their back. When thou shalt make ready. Ready the what? Thine arrows. For upon what? Upon thy strings against the face of them. Why did he say the back of Ooh. Didn't say the back of them. Now, I ain't shooting them in the back. God said, that's a pump move. Yeah. But they're going to turn their back. The reason why I don't want them to see, amen, they're not going to get a chance to repent for what they did. They back going to get turned. Yes, Lord. But the arrows is for the face of them. Yeah. I'm going to make them turn around, amen. When they turn around, they're going to have an arrow in their face. Somebody t- tell God, thank you. Yeah, Lord. Ain't nobody got away with nothing. That's a bad scripture. See, see, it, we should. It, it should have said, "When thou shalt make ready thy arrows upon the strings against the back of them." Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I don't want them to see it. Now yeah. turn around. Turn around and get this. Hm. I don't see no tears in verse thirteen. Be thou exalted, Lord. <laughs> uh, y'all, man, y'all, man, you can't rewrite the Bible because you got more love than God. How many of y'all know uh, uh, Putin ain't getting away with nothing? It, it, right. It's all. That's right. He is not. Somebody said, why did they take Biden to the hospital? Because he keep on Putin. Now, that, that, I, that wasn't my joke. Because <laughs> he keep on Putin. Now, 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 now that, that wasn't my joke. <laughs> that ain't right. <laughs> he, he keep on Putin. <laughs> Now, man, uh, they'll be trying to steal that joke. Huh? Uh, but, but, but Putin ain't out of God's reach. No. no I told, it's only, we got a book club here, only two people, me and my assistant pastor. I don't know what else y'all do. So this is a book coming out. It doesn't get released till June. And it gives you the ins and outs of what's going on. Like, the reason why the, the other countries, you know, a lot of things they're doing that they say they're doing is all symbolic, all right? It's just to make you think they're doing something, all right? But the other companies, you know, they, they can't because he, you know, he's a number one oil producer. He's got natural gas. He cut their likes out. Huh? The polo man there, he don't know he's collateral damage. He don't know that. He said, no, we can't have enough flying at the airspace because we can't afford to go to war. Wow, people. Those people, one day, they was, you know, Ukraine, living their life, going to clubs, going to night dinner. They, they weren't bothering nobody. Right, right. Now they're at a bunker somewhere. Right. Me and family, separate. See, all the stuff we take for granted, you come in here like, uh, somebody else getting separated from their husband, their mama, everything. The only thing they had, amen. Can you imagine only having what you got on right now? Now, some of us got a lot of clothes. I got a lot of stuff. Can you imagine what all that I have is all I got left? That's why you can't pray. That's why you can't give God glory. Because it's all on TV. It's not your reality. But Putin ain't out of God's reach. I tell you what, some of the folk in Ukraine who weren't praying, they praying now. Man, they sitting in synagogues in the basement they in subway they in bunkers but whatever they have on mothers with children 
all the stuff you take for granted, bathing and eating and brushing your teeth and whatever, it's all in line for hours, days. Yeah. Somebody give God some glory, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Glory. Yeah. Those aren't actors and actresses. No. There's no teleprompter. No, 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 no. Those are human beings who life changed in a day. Yeah. 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 But this, this man ain't out of God's reach. No, sir. Huh? Was Nebuchadnezzar out of God's reach? Oh, sure was. I just be, you know, Trey, I just be telling God, I really be trying to aggravate God about him. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Nah, I'm, I'm up for some Old Testament. There ain't nothing like, you could read it, ain't nothing like seeing God do it. Right. <laughs> I'm like, God, he, he think he God-like. Yeah, he I does. just be trying to pick at God, yeah, like, 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 just show me he ain't God-like. That's like, I want him to do an interview and blood shoot out the side of his face, huh? Uh-huh. Huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I want blood to come out his eyeball like Giuliani's die ran down his face, all right? Right, right. Uh-uh. Okay, all right, all right, all right. I hear you. I'm with you. No, no, no. Yeah. no he's acting God like. Yeah. Even though, I'm going to mess with him, even though he's in the plan of God. Yeah, yeah. Oh, if he ain't in the plan, that means he's operating outside. Then, uh, then that means he's God. Right. He's in the plan. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But God wouldn't. Mm-hmm. I'll show you something. Mm-hmm. Uh, but we'll get to it. <laughs> but back to your enemy. Don't worry about your enemy. Uh, be thou exalted, Lord, in thy own strength. So will we sing and praise thy power? It just goes to show you all you have is God. That's right. Uh, that all those leaders... If it comes between their lights being on, their economy, we'll give up a whole nation. And you thought you was important. All you have is God. Do do some research. Quit watching BET and the one uh, Master P movie and the other two movies they show. The old nigger on a bicycle riding around getting choked out by a thug, huh? Quit, quit watching that for a minute. <laughs> Baby boy. Right. Now, some of y'all should never watch that again. Like, you already had a baby boy. A nigger only had was a bicycle. You should, every time you come, every time that come on, you ought to cut the TV off. <laughs> now, you sit next to Baby boy and can't say amen. All right. <laughs> you see what's going on? Oops. <laughs> Baby boy said, you better not say amen. Uh-oh. I just got my bike fixed. <laughs> You'll find out those, co- those countries. <laughs> and the man said, can I just get in NATO? That way it's a whole new game. You're in NATO. It's one of those articles say that you come in like Putin don't know the boundaries. But if it comes down to sacrificing this whole country for the rest of us, they are going to be, they are being sacrificed. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. I just want, I don't know, but, but, but if God fight for them, That's right. I'm up for it. Yes. I stay up all night, watch God fight for them. Yes. Uh, oh yeah. Center God. Yeah. 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 There's some Jews down there, man. They better be careful. They start swaying. That's right. They start rocking. We talking about the Orthodox. Yep. Like y'all, y'all, y'all. Like if it ain't if it if it ain't on Saratoga or Highball, you don't care. All right. A lady there from the Holocaust. Nah, they they may lead, may lead, may lead. If it ain't da 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 da, they don't care. <laughs> Man, that's it. They still in the Super Bowl. <laughs> I wanted to marry Bly, finally get that outfit off. It was glued on her. And I hope she washed it. Uh, back to uh, uh, Hebrews. By faith, Enoch was translated that he should not see death. You know, I'm, I'm, I'll keep going. Yeah. And was not found because God 
had translated him, for before his translation, he had this testimony that he pleased God. Uh, Crystal was translated, just like God, like, you know what? Yes, yes. Amen. I'm taking my gift back. Gift the Lord, God, gift of the church. God, like, it belonged to me. I'm telling you, come on back. Yeah. Come on back. Trans, that's what translate. Now, I'm going to mess with y'all. Saints don't die. They just get translated. Amen. Amen. So, saint, a saint will live forever. This spirit, does her spirit still live? Yes. Or you got to be kidding. You better believe it, huh? Yeah. In this church. Yeah. Okay, y'all. Saints, translated. Okay. That was length of days. Three score and 10, which is 70. By reasonable strength, four score, 80. Hmm? And yet there's 90. Yet and there's a word in the Bible where 120. Okay, I ain't got time to. All right, read. But. Without what? Without singing. But without faith. Without a smoke machine. Faith. Without a mass choir. Faith. Without a tambourine that can take getting the hell beat out of it. <laughs> but without what? Faith. But without faith. Mm. Is what? It is impossible to please him. That was mission impossible. 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 Okay. To please him. Yes. That's a powerful scripture. Yes, it is. Impossible. Man of God said, why would you want to walk with somebody who don't believe in you? No faith in you. You know that ends marriages? Oh, okay. No faith. You marry somebody who don't believe in you. Now, I ain't talking about you. How can they believe if you ain't employed? I ain't talking about that. I'm, I'm talking about. I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we, 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 we talking about who, who have a vision and they're working toward it. Faith without works is dead. Mm. So you have faith where your works. You got somebody who doesn't believe. Unequally yoked together. You booed up with an unbeliever. They go to church, but they really don't believe. Notice with Sonia, uh, I, did I bring up uh, 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 Keith and his girlfriend? That I bring up, Lee. I don't care, man, Lisa and her boo. Huh? Uh, man, I brought up man, a man and woman of God. Right. And even, uh, I supposed to be praying for her condition, but I pray that God bless her with a key. That's right. Yes, you did. Now, that would mess you up. If the only reason why that sis came up was so I could pray that she could get a key. Now, you would be mad. You, you would be sitting there, uh-huh, uh, uh, praying for swelling. God don't never do one thing at a time. You ain't heard? Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Now, now you like, I think I feel something, Bishop. <laughs> now, nah, what you feel is repentance. You need to repent for that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that wasn't funny. Read. But without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh, cometh to, God, to God, read, must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. You know what I want? Mm -hmm. So I took some of y'all back to Grant Garland. He said, all I want is just a plain and simple girl. No, I ain't singing that, all right? I just got this RB. I got this jukebox in me I can't get rid of. All right? Go ahead. You know what I want? I want Quana and Mouse and Coach and Shaquita. I just want them to sit there now and believe that he is. That's right. That he is. Yes, Lord. They're faithful and they're giving. They're faithful and whatever. Huh? But we got to cross over. Believe it. We got to cross it. over yeah. being a good person. We got to cross over do the right thing. We got to go to that next rung on that ladder. 
And when you see how simple it is, remember I talk about the blueprint? When I show you how simple it is, you'll be like, that's all I had to do was believe that he is. To where you'll open your mouth. Lord, look what you've done for the Jackson family. Look what you've done. Look what you've done. Look what you've done for Kobe, for me. Look what you did for me, God. He believe that he is. He is. A re- that is a reward of them that w- seek him how? Diligently. That ain't casual. Diligently. Mm-hmm. Huh? Well, you see how you be like. Yes, Lord. That's all I had to do. Hallelujah. Yeah. It's easier to talk about him than to seek him diligently. Mm-hmm. Because he is, whether you whatever you say is, it doesn't matter. He still is. He still is. But that Next breath, <laughs> that obsession, I got to have it. Here's what I told Miles. Me and Miles, Miles, Miles this whole list of folk, he rolling. You know why this stuff happens to you? Because you, you're a man's man, and a lot of times with men, it's just, when it comes to another man, you like, like, okay, what's his angle? So a lot of things you bring on yourself. I don't have an angle. Okay? I don't have it. So on Wednesday, when, when Brian orchestrated. Yes, yes. That they gave me those shoes. Yes. And I sat there and didn't have nothing to say. That's when a rare time. I ain't got nothing to say because I'm not used to that. Right. But there was no angle. I didn't hint to him. Whatever. Matter of fact, to stop you from looking it up, they cost $200. All right? Just, yeah. just, to, just to let you know, he didn't go to City Trends. And they keep rest of the money. They twelve hundred dollars. All right, I think twelve twenty to be exact. All right. Yeah. So I, I'm just helping y'all. Some of y'all are like, I, where, where did my five dollars go? Well, <laughs> it took some other fives to make it happen. <laughs> but but I didn't. There was no angle to that. No. Huh? Now I'm gonna help y'all. Show you that with no angle. And I just like, man, what do I say? I, I bless people. Real love. Matter of fact, I got a coat I bought back that I that I bought that's they mispriced. It's like a nine hundred dollar coat. And uh, I just bought it back because I'm going to give it to somebody. I ain't never wore it. It's like the price went up on it. Uh, no, don't send me no note. All right. It's, just, it's oversized. You know, I finally got the right size and somewhere in Europe. And I don't know why I bought this size. I, I know why because I was supposed to give it away to somebody. It's $900 coat. I think it's going up. Or whatever. Anyway, so when he, when he brought those shoes, yeah. I can show you a scripture that you don't understand. And I was, I, I thought he was going to show me the Louis piece he bought for himself. I'm like, man, because I, man, I'm, I'm encouraging him. I like spending his money and Jay's money. I do. It's fun. <laughs> he going to surprise me. But the scripture, what he fulfilled and everybody who participated. Beautiful are the feet. Uh, woo, yes. There it is. Uh, 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 there it is. <laughs> I know I'm all over the place, but this is going to help somebody. Yes. I'm going to show you something. Uh, I ain't got no angle. If you're looking for an angle, man, I ain't got one. I ain't got no angle. Uh-uh. I didn't know that was going to happen. I was in shock. Yes. But I do know what he did. Yes. Uh, where is that at? Is that- <laughs> uh-uh, here it is. Romans 10, <laughs> uh, right. verse 14. How then shall they call on him? And whom they have not believed, and how shall they believe in him of whom they have not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? preacher? And how shall they preach except a grandfather? See, the problem is they made of the, the house of God a family business. Mm-hmm. How beautiful. So Cammy going to make it 712 apostale. <laughs> yes. Y'all stand. Lord, we love you. All right, y'all go home. I'll see y'all Tuesday. <laughs> yeah. How, beautiful. How beautiful are the feet. feet of them 
that preach the gospel of peace, peace uh oh, and bring good tidings of good things. Yes. So if my feet are pretty, twelve hundred dollars to do it, uh, <laughs> huh? What you invested in, whether it was five, ten, a hundred, whatever, was good tidings of good things. You got something coming. You can't beautify my feet and not receive the rest of the scripture. I ain't got an angle. Whatever I walk into, you done walked into. Yeah. It's, it's still true. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so, so, back to mouse. Some of this list, his effort, whatever, it happened. They left him out. <laughs> I said, see? That's how I talked to me. See? I told you. I was a bit more surprised. It only happened because of him. I said, see, I gave, you saw the blueprint on, was that Tuesday when the Holy Ghost fell on Dante? And she, yes. I told you. Yes. Mm -hmm. No matter what, that's, that's the blueprint that, that God, if he frames a blessing for you, they don't have to give you the credit. Mm -hmm. You already been framed for the blessing. That's right. But if you don't know that, that it's the word of God, yeah. you'll fool around and act up and do something and get outside the frame or think that somehow by them not recognizing it was your effort, that it's time for you to move on. So you got to have a word. If you don't have a word, you'll make emotional moves. How many of y'all made emotional moves on, before? Huh? Yeah. All right. All right. Back, back to what was I dealing with? Back to that. That was just for Hebrews. I was in Hebrews. Keep going. I'm going to finish it. It's a whole lot with Abraham, no. Read. By faith, Noah, being warned of God, of things not seen as yet, moved with fear, prepared an ark to the saving of his house. Boy, does Ukraine, did they near Noah? Sure enough. It's too late now. They he here now. Yep. They needed a Noah. <laughs> They needed a Noah. Okay. That's the day folk needed a Noah. Of things not yet seen as yet. Move with fear. Prepared an ark. He had needed an ark. Mm -hmm. To the saving of his house by which he condemned the world and became the heir of the righteous which is by faith. Read. Here we go. I'm on land. By faith, Abraham, when he was called to go out into a place which he should after receive for an inheritance. What did he do? Obeyed. Obeyed. Didn't know where he was going. And he went out not knowing whither, where he, whither he went. Mm -hmm. See why you got to put some respect on his name? Yes, sir. Not knowing. Just leave us. Not knowing mm. when you can't see it, <laughs> you can't. If you can't see it, you'll lose your mind in the outer court. Yeah, I, I jumped some because that's only by natural sunlight what everybody can see. Mm? So a lot of people talking about Abraham ain't a bit more close to Abraham. You can name your child Abraham and he not be Abraham. Okay. <laughs> Because he went somewhere not knowing. Right. So where is that place in the tabernacle that you go somewhere and you believe it and you don't know where you're going? That's the inner court. Right. Mm. You, in the Lord. inner court, you can't tell everybody yeah. what you've seen in the spirit, huh? Yeah. Matter of fact, if you worship in the 
inner court. If you know what you know what you know, even though you can't see it, folk will say you've lost your mind. But I got some worshipers in here who, amen, are thankful they worship because of the ways of God. They already, you can't convince them on this day that God is not going to do and perform what he said he was going to perform. They are fully persuaded they don't see it, but they do see it in the spirit. They don't see it in the natural eye, but they spiritual eye. And that's why they come to church and worship. I know there's only a handful of them. By faith, he sojourned in the land of promise as in a strange country. Dwelling in tabernacles with Isaac and Jacob, the heirs with him of the same promise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For he looked for a city which had foundation, who built her maker is God. All right, it's a whole lot to that. Uh, remember, we're going to be on this until it's time to get off of it. Get Job 23. If he sends me there, Elijah, he's going to take care of you. When the brook key riff dry up, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, people have problems with me other than, you know, the, it, the, 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 he used to be my mailman. Key word is used to be. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I remember when he started on 33rd and Parker. Good. Mm -hmm. When he used to go out there and help the kids. Good. Isn't that beautiful that God said Reverend Barlow? I don't even know who that is. <laughs> to help the kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all that's good. <laughs> that was then. <laughs> it's good he out there to keep one, two in the morning. They shooting clowning. Pleasant View East, Pleasant View West, Hilltop, Vietnam. Some of y'all, I'm taking you down memory lane. Look at you. Huh? One time I had South Family. Who are I having there today? South Family, 33rd, because I knew the Tonys. Uh, uh, Gumballing now. What were they called? Lomas. All sitting in the same church. We had them all sectioned off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, ain't that good by Reverend Barlow. And I told you the mistake I made. I didn't know it was on me. I'm trying to share. When I didn't have no business sharing it. Amen. I tried to share it because the other people was looking at me crazy because I wasn't from here. <laughs> but it was God. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. And what happens is. What else is God going to do? He's going to bless you. Uh, when, 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 when men ride over your head, when he brings you to the net, when he let people do things, he can't change his word. He don't even change his word if you don't understand. That's right. He's able to perform what he said he's going to do. Yeah. Amen. Huh? So you don't even have to understand. So when the Brook Key, which was the post office, dried up, uh, and then I had my first group of, with just kids. I only went, only person I got left from that first group who knew all of them was Deborah. All right? Uh, not this Deborah. There's another Deborah back there. Right. All right? <laughs> it's new Deborah right here. Same person, but new person. Okay? Yeah. But then I went to Zarephath. Because when you Elijah and your brook key rib dry up, you ain't dying. Man, the God said, nothing that God frames is going to die. He can't speak something in that is going to, man, y'all ain't listening. Come on, Bishop, teach it. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to help with maybe one person. You worried about something that ain't going to happen. If God spoke it, he's going to perform it. Just because you can't see it is because you're looking on the wrong side of God. That's right. Hallelujah. 
Let me make my point and go to my other church. <laughs> now, my daughter over in my other church, the, the girl that got fired, that already accused me of going with her. What? Come on, now I'm OG about that. I don't know if she had tats, but I can't. I got too much hair on my arm. I've been and bled out. I don't, and I'm scared of needles. Uh-huh. Yeah, accused me of. Just got there and got fired. <laughs> Because I tell you, when I sit down, here they come. They're going to line up Another blessing. to listen to what make you mad. <laughs> Every last one, I'm, I brought tears out. I made one go in the bathroom and say, don't come out to get yourself together. Right. I, <laughs> grown woman who's been to the pen, who know all my, who, who know our folk. She hooked up with some meth head who was beating on her. And he showed me, she showed me all her, her, her marks, and she crying. I said, girl, when are you going to love yourself? He only treats you how you feel about yourself. She start crying. Now go to the bathroom, eat yourself together. That, you know what I'm talking about. She knows Shani, she knows everybody. Been to the pen, okay? So they're gonna line up. Well, the girl got mad because the girl got excited about the cars because she like cars. She said, Well, now she said that 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 you my boyfriend. I said, Well, that don't it scare you, it don't scare me. <laughs> all right, all right, that don't mm. come on now. So I'm, boy, I'm supposed to do go to Cracker Barrel now. I don't like Cracker Barrel. That's where Glenda go. Uh, I'm going to Cracker Barrel now because I can't take that. I ain't going to Cracker Barrel. It's two crackheads. No yeah, man, 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 I ain't, man they, got, they got my order where I'm going to go. I ain't no Cracker Barrel. What, what that, what that, uh, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> That's my other church, Green right Head too. Look at verse 8, Job 23. Behold, I go forth. This is Job. And I wish, I wish people would just read all of Job and not take that one little part. Because they take the humanness out of it, the humanity out of suffering. <laughs> uh, the longer you suffer, you don't have a word. That, man, your faith going to ebb out. <laughs> okay. All right, test it. Mm-hmm. Behold, I go forward. This is Job. He's searching. Right. But he's not there. Mm-hmm. Somebody here feel that way. Yep. Backward, moonwalk. <laughs> <laughs> you thought right. it started with Michael. But I, cannot perceive- but I cannot perceive him. This is for one person. On the left hand. On the left hand where he doth work, but I can't behold him. Uh, he working on the left hand, I can't see it. I want to worship right now. I praise I gave you a chance. You sat there, you full of yourself, you stick it to your chair. I'm done with you. <laughs> I'm done with praisers. Man, you getting out trying to pray at 813. I'm into worshipers now. On the left hand, I don't see it, but I know. Yes, yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. Huh? Who in here know I got a left hand, even though I'm hiding it? Oh, this is good. I is a worshiper. You praise her, sit down. Who know I got a left hand? Who know I got a left hand? I'm trying to help a word. Who know I got a left hand? Do you know I got a left hand? Do you know God already know where you're supposed to be? Do you know, huh? Do you know what you know, Mo? Who know I got a left hand? Come on, worshiper. You can't see it. But you know I got one. You can't see it, but God working. You can't see it, but your blessing already framed. You can't see it, but your healing is complete. You can't see it. But I got a left hand, y'all. Yeah. Yes, hallelujah. Jody's sister was in a situation. Huh? But she's here now because God had a left hand. 
this. He couldn't see it. One more time, worshiper. You know I got a left hand. The reason why you haven't given given up, the reason why you haven't went back to the honey dripper lounge, the reason why you're not back on your bar stool, the reason why you're not back on your back on a mattress is because you know God, amen, is doing something, amen, that you can't see. You're a worshiper. <laughs> May gotta take a picture of my hidden left. Y'all know I got a left hand. I got a hidden too, don't I? Now see, if you don't know me, you're like, man, what happened to your pastor's arm? Huh? And, and look, 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 at, look at the sleeve just swinging. Huh? I had the wind blowing. Huh? He, and you all get discouraged. Come, I leave my, my little, my little sleeve just blowing. And you don't see. But I got something. I got something. Just when you think it's over. Just when you think, uh-huh. Oh, I'm trying to mess with somebody. Huh? Only a worshiper. Don't make no move because something you can't see. <sighs> Where he does work, but I cannot behold him. Uh oh. He hid himself. Uh oh. Did he have an accident? Did you think God had an accident? Did you think God had forgot about you? He spoke you into these seats. He let bullet whiz over your head. He let your car stop with bad brakes, your tires ball, your transmission. You did folk wrong and he wouldn't let them find you. Huh? Failed suicide attempts. You think God somehow got crippled. And he don't know what he's doing. Because you can't see it. Remember, praise us, I, you had a chance. This is for worshipers who can't see nothing. I don't see the left arm. The right arm is hidden. But I know what 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 I know I see it. I seen it. Where'd you see it at? I saw it in the inner court. I'm about finished. But he know it. He had himself on the right hand. I cannot see him. Uh oh. But he know it. Yes, he know it. The way that I take. Yes. He know it. What he's already framed for me. He can't frame the world and not frame my world. Amen. He know it. Some worshiper worship God for what he knows. Not what you know, but what he knows. He know it. The way that I take. When he have tried me, I shall come forth. Come on now. I'm going to come forth. These are my golden years, and I'm not talking about age. I'm talking about coming forth because I've been tried. I 
want my golden folk. Can't nobody stop what God has for you. It's already framed. Folk want to go, but they don't want to be tried. My foot have held his steps. His ways, his way have I kept and not declined. Neither have I gone back from the commandment of his lips. I've esteemed the words of his mouth more than my necessary food. That's where that scripture came from. How many of y'all remember when you lost your appetite and the only thing you had was the word because of pressure, because your flesh, your body, your mind collapsed and the only thing you had left was a word. Without a word, you would have walked away from 712. Without a word, Brandon, you'd have hung up your business. Without a word, mouse. Who in here need a word? Amen. I got to have a word. Amen. A word that frames me. Without a word, Daryl, you'll go to Seattle and not come back. You got to have a word. I'm about done. Verse 13. Now, know about food. Man, some of y'all, man, if I say fast now, which won't be till the last Friday of March, you already start getting a headache. <laughs> you eat once a day, but it's all day. <laughs> now, y'all look like y'all been eating. <laughs> yeah. Then you lie. <laughs> Come on. Why y'all looking at each other? Don't, don't, man, don't, don't, don't make an enemy because you're looking at somebody. <laughs> Then you lie. Come on, help my liars. Remember, Abraham was a liar too. <laughs> this dress got too small. No, it didn't. <laughs> dress the same size. Unless you washed it wrong. Now, you do have to read the label now. Okay. <laughs> you can't put it in hot water and a hot dryer. But that thing ain't been washed yet and it don't fit. <laughs> it's got <laughs> it's gotten too small no it hasn't <laughs> these pants shrunk no they haven't that thigh got too big <laughs> yeah All right. Just think if that heft was the word of God. Yes. Thank you, God. <laughs> hmm? We know some of you, not only do you not read, <laughs> food is your other God. <laughs> oh, no, you can worry yourself and keep eating. That's for real. No, that's real. Huh? Now, somebody left you in eighth grade. You still eating the donuts, the, 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 the donuts you celebrated. <laughs> and they left you in eighth grade. Broke up with you in homeroom. You, hey, you, been, you, been, you still broke, broke still up breathing. with you in homeroom. And you ain't got over it. You've been eating since. <laughs> homeroom. If think if that had been the word of God. Come on. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I lost my appetite. No, not for food, but the word. Come on, that's help. Uh, yeah. That's help. That's help. That is help. Let's say you lose your appetite because of sick, whatever, because of stress. But you still eat the word. Your appetite gonna come back. Ah, how y'all like that? Amen. All right, now you you don't you don't know the way. All right. Okay. 
Verse 13, I, you know, I ain't going to continue. I, I, look, verse 13, but he is in one mind, and who can turn him? No one. And what his soul desires, even. even that, we talking about God, he doeth. Here where I'm gonna land at. For he performeth. Uh -huh. Come on, Brandy. He performeth. I don't see no left arm or right arm of finance. <laughs> the housing market, people are getting 30, 40 grand over, no inspection. That ain't got nothing to do with what God said he's gonna perform. You done sold with a kingdom offering. Now it's up to heaven, amen. You ain't got to see an arm. You ain't got to see a left or a right arm. But God said, I'm going to perform it. Come on, worship her. I need a worshiper, amen, to worship God. The thing that is appointed. For me. Uh oh, not one thing, not three things, not five things, not ten, and many. Everybody say many. Many, many such things are with him. Come on, there's something after he do this, he gonna do something else for you. I said after he do this, he gonna do something else. And after he does that, he gonna do something else. Now worship God for being a performer, a performer with the left hand, the right hand, even though you don't see it. That's for worshipers. You're going to perform it. Come on, are you fully persuaded? You're going to perform it. Every head bow. That's it. To my other church I go. Pray, KT. Let me get my arms back so y'all believe. Precious Lord, Father, and Savior in heaven. Lord, we thank you. We thank you for your word. Because without it, we can do nothing. We thank you, Father, for a sanctuary we can come to and receive help and receive our strength, Lord. Hallelujah. We thank you, Father. For a reminder that you are a rewarder of them that diligently seek them. Bishop doesn't even know. Saint texted me yesterday. And I texted them back. And he told that same person exactly what I told them. And he had no clue. There's definitely help in the sanctuary. For each and every one of us. All we have to do is pass the test so that we can come out golden. Father, we thank you because we cannot fast from your word. Beautiful. We do not serve an armless God. And we must remember that. Despite our circumstance, despite how it looks,
There's an appointment. You got a, a worshiper who will see the appointment without saying, I know that arm or right arm. So when a person gets up nerve to ask you, sir, I, 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 I don't know how you're going to do it. That's why I can't talk to you because I don't believe you can buy. But I know he's going to do it. Uh, I, I don't care. I'll, I'll bring it to the outer court after he's done the right arm. I need the court, but I'm worshiping like it's done. Help a girl out of you for the husband that God said, I'll show you. You precious ain't good this morning. Put your name Brooke up. They could have named you Sneak Junior, but they did. So, Lord, we thank you for preparing us by exercising your word. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. 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 Is there one? Young man, young lady, you ever need to repent? Be baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Don't know who on the third row is going to have ministry and they daydreaming now, but don't worry, that pot going to get heat up, heated up. You don't know who God dealing with. Why Caleb up there sitting alone? He waiting on Joshua. He can only run with Joshua. If his mama wanted him huh, to have friends, she should have named him Charles. <laughs> who the one in Florida that love everyone? That Larry. <laughs> huh? If he, she wanted him to love everyone, she should have named him Larry. So he could float on, but she didn't. <laughs> she named him Caleb. He can only run with Joshua. He'll never age. I'm coming to buy, at 80, he'll look like he's still, man. 40 years ago by now, you know you need that Caleb on you. <laughs> Forty years and you know and you don't age, huh? Take those crow feet out your eyes, huh? Take that frown dent out your forehead. Come on now, get that Caleb on you. <laughs> well, you're still youthful. Are you here, young man, young lady? Are you here? This is your time. Your time. Say, so why are you coming? Cause I just dawned on me I'm framed, and I believe God. And this is the life I want. That's why it's very important for people to see saints happy. Joy is fun. Dancing, laughing. Huh? 
Aren't you glad we ain't got no buckshot in church full of evil folk? Shouting and acting like they're in an MMA octagon, beating folk half to death. <laughs> folk had to come to church and tap out because you done beat them half to death. Talking about you shouting. Y'all ain't know what I'm talking about. Hey, Amen. Glenn know what I'm talking about. Folk that came to church and left with a bloody nose. <laughs> this ain't that kind of church. Are you here, young man, young lady? There's some happy folk in here. Fun people. Come on, young man, young lady. Amen. You, you visit, but come on, join them. Repent. Everyone here that you see is, they've been baptized in Jesus' name. I'll come the same way. Rich, poor, indifferent, don't matter. God will fill you with the Holy Ghost. If you had decided to come to Bible class on Tuesday, <laughs> ain't nobody going to make no house, no house calls. You think we DoorDash or something. We ain't no DoorDash. <laughs> you would have heard. He did what I told you. You would have heard it. Fell on Dante, fell on Shelly Bean. You'll hear it. Did you hear Sonia? That ain't no stammering lips. A genuine Holy Ghost. I'll tell you, it's real. Okay. That's what God has for you. That's the power of God. Don't worry. I was frightened too. I said, oh my goodness. What's wrong with those people's neck? People jerking and stuff. I think, oh, God, no. Mm-hmm. Well, that's why I got my afro had to get in the ground, and I lost my Egyptian chain. I'm glad you went there because I can see you snapping. Look at Lita Le- already laughing, just a visual. Huh? Just a visual. Are you here, young man, young lady? Come out with your hands up, Lord. I surrender all. Come up your hands up. Lord, it's time so you can walk in the newness of life. You get up this early in the morning sitting here at work. When you get home, folk will be getting on at 12 live choir praise team. You already up to hear word. No entertainment here. Pure word. Pure word. Ain't no, ain't no entertainment. You provide your own entertainment. Are you here, young man, young lady? No one? We thank God for another day in the sanctuary. Amen. Huh? All right. For a round. Ken Trail, NBA young boy, come here and get filled with the Holy Ghost. Then you're going to want to sit up front and say, no, you stay right back there. Go back to sleep. Amen. He wants something. Hmm? You, hey, they don't know. Tamika tell you. Ain't no telling who I run into on the plane or who, who I'm appointed to run into. Uh, Raphael in Italy right now. Raphael went to Serbia, Italy. Uh-huh. And went, hey, we're supposed to meet up in Monaco. Ain't no telling who's going to be there. Amen. Let's collect our tithes and offering and go home. Now, uh, this is a little inside joke, sis. Uh, amen. It's, <clears throat> Sister B is not here because uh, she took that other shot and had the effect. But I'm just trying to help some folk because we found out that Lita does this doula thing with babies. And they had a little doula party. And that they was handing out this tea. It looked like regular tea. And then come to find out, my wife took a bottle of it. Come to find Come to find out. Come to find out it was fertility tea. And my wife drunk some. And I was teasing Lisa and Keith. And here my wife done squeezed if I had another bottle. And you So I told him, it, 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 for, I'm going to go send her to Lowe's to get some paint thinner. <laughs> Gargle with some paint thinner. And get that out of her. I was, Danielle, you've been dissing me the whole, now you're laughing. 
I would have never, shut up. I would have never said that with Lisa and Keith if I know my wife had guzzled some fertility tea. I'm a lot of things, but I'm not stupid. You babysit, I ain't stutting y'all. You show sure healed quickly. So she. And we are so excited. We are so excited. So, a couple things, a couple things, a couple things. I don't even know how to open this one. Okay, here we go. What's, what we got? What we got here? Let me see what we got here. What's this first one? Rip stuff open. Oh, damn. For those cold, those cold mornings. Headed to breakfast. <laughs> what, what does it say? Automobile Lamborghini. Lamborghini. <laughs> you know how hard this stuff is to get at? Well, we got it, so. replica car that it's in a case so car comes with it but if you try to buy it separately the replica car costs seven eight hundred dollars and they're sold out there is no way in the world matter of fact the guy from your car just texts me there is no way in the world with the wealthy Athletes, the James Hardens that make 40 million a year, the people, 12 the girlfriends, soccer players, NHL players, baseball players, dot com people. Ain't nowhere in the world I'm supposed to have that vehicle. But God, He hid it. do this they talking about y'all cuz of me like I don't know This row is taped off, but I gotta sit down. <laughs> so it wasn't enough to beautify my feet once. Y'all done doubled up on yourself. Amen. Y'all done. I Oh, 
those cars more than the other one. What y'all trying to do? That is, that is. Man, I. Here's what, here's what, here's what y'all don't know. There are a lot of people to watch this church. A lot of pastors. And you guys are the envy. Because word gets us a small city. They know we don't do car washes. They know we don't walk around three and four times for offering. They know it's envelopes. Queenie. That's why Queenie going to be wealthy. Envelopes. It's all envelopes. Some people cash out. Some people, Sonia, put in the bank themselves. Faithful people. And I talked to somebody who I said I wasn't talking to no more. But God said, no, it's new season. And I told them how it happened, that it was faith and obedience. And most of these pastors, I got people here to make big money, but I don't never recruit other people's members. I never. I don't want them. Hmm? First of all, if you're a man or woman of God, you're not graced for their problems. Because everybody comes with problems, and I don't want them. And you guys have become the envy. And I just told you, I know they're talking about you because of how you treat me and how I live. Now they're going to be talking about you because you can't do this, people. This is a principle. You can't double up and God not double up on you. Huh? He's going to double up on you. Y'all, y'all, y'all clapping, but y'all do understand. I want you to worship knowing that God, gonna, you can't do this. Uh, hold, hold, hold up, let, let, me, let me talk to somebody who don't know the story. Jody's sister. Jody's sister. The reason why I am where I am is because I did this. I blessed a man. You know what I feel led to do? I'm going to read the prophecy. Okay? I blessed a man in the year 2000 with a 2001 BMW. With no help. I turned down a $101,000 car. My mother's with me. She come back from the grave. She says, you're standing right there with me in the Mercedes dealership. And I blessed a man with a BMW. Brand new. It had six miles on it. I didn't want Jerry Rose's girlfriend to drive the car. Don't put your girlfriend butt in that car. They delivered it to him. They hit it in. Man, he should have got in himself. Eddie Long's garage. And they presented to him in Atlanta that it was on a, it was on a, a, a carousel. Okay, she was there. That was in 2000, okay? 2004, I don't think I've got the things with me. That's when Ernie and Tariq and all them and the, all those people went out to read her and all that kind of stuff, 2004, okay? This is real. So couldn't nobody stop me from having cars because I blessed a man with a car, huh? Y'all doubled up on my feet being beautiful. That means you got glad double what you thought was single. You got double. Whoever you are. It's a law. It's a principle. It's not a gimmick. No gimmick. I'm going I'm to read the prophecy. And when they hear about this. No one, here's what some people say, who didn't even, they just jealous. Because they got all kind of 
dinners and this and that and whatever. And, huh? We don't even have a PPP loan, folk. None. <laughs> so even before all this, I heard them. Because mainly we got those ears. They worship him. No, I talk too crazy for you to worship me. <laughs> Man, I talk crazy. Why? I believe God. I believe God. Then I see your feelings. Sometimes I know I hurt your feelings. And I go home. I don't even know who to call. Because I know I wouldn't have said it in my right mind. Ain't no way in the world I would say that stuff. I be having mind fights. You can't imagine. Oh, they gone now. <laughs> so they say they worship him. All because they got to sell dinners and man, me and, me and Shelly Bean can tell you horror stories. Three and four times around. If you don't give, your name was on a list in the vestibule. Remember that, Tracy? <laughs> You heard me, man. I ain't making this stuff up. So if you should quit and rob her, you feel good because you got it. But if you was a sacrifice, you sacrificed and you just didn't have it, everybody in the church looked on the board. Am I lying, Shelly Beans? Everybody knew about it. So look how that would have messed me up. One time the bells were broke students. They ain't broke no more. No, they weren't. I want to read this to you. I was going to save it, but I got to read it because I got new people here. Y'all have no idea. Y'all blew me away, folk. Y'all blew yourself away because <laughs> God can't lie. Come on now, where is it at? Myla wrote it down, and then I asked a couple of people. Oh, here it is. Here it is right here. You ready for this? This was June 23rd, 2009. We was at Ambassador Worship Center. Packed house. So Bishop Bismarck, I'll give you the context, used to run around. When he comes to a city, he would run around the perimeter because there are demonic angels on every, that's what you're up against, demonic angels in every city. Okay, see y'all, see, don't mix up coming to church with real worship and being part of the body. Okay. The average black church is just an entertainment place. It's all pure entertainment. It's a subculture. Well, this man, you know, he Goes around the perimeter and runs to rebuke the demonic princess. This is his words. So 2004, I'm in the newspaper. Man, my name, I'm, my name been hot a long time. Okay. It's funny, I was talking about war on Wednesday, and y'all did it. Now I come back, and y'all done doubled up. Here's a prophecy that you ran into. He said, I was, it's a hot day in summertime. He said, I was about dying running. It was so hot. Then he told a joke. He said, I saw a dog chasing a cat. They were both walking. It was so hot. He said, I need prayer. Listen to this. But as I was coming close to the hotel, you just popped into my spirit. And a BMW just popped in my spirit. So you're thinking, oh, that was just the BMW that you gave in 2000. Uh, it was 2001 and 2000. No, it wasn't. It was the BMW that I bought, which was a 2022, mm -hmm. that I only had for a month. It was the black one that was out there. He saw that BMW in 2009. Tell you because a prophecy is 100%. See, it, that would be slick to be the BMW I already gave. And this is eight years later. Uh uh. I'm getting that car thinking because I like, because you know, it's different. The big grill grill. No, I'm getting it because it had to fulfill the prophecy. I'm not knowing it. Right, here, I'm a, here it is right here. 
just popped in my spirit. The Lord just showed me a BMW, and it's not about the car. God's about to provide you with another set of wheels because where you're going in business and ministry and in your life, the set of wheels you're riding on is not going to get you there. So you're coming into another season where God's about to get you another set of wheels. Now here's a, a, a Bible a scripture used. The Ethiopian eunuch was in a set of wheels but it wasn't getting him where he had to go. Philip had to come and jack him up. That's in the book of Acts. So God's about to give you another set of wheels. Your ministry, your life, your business is about to get an increase in mobility that you have not had before. And to prove it, God's going to open a door for you to get a real car. A set of wheels that when you see it, you know the spirit of empowerment is going to take you to the next level. <laughs> Elijah's chariot, Elijah, Elijah's about to mantle. You're about to get another set of wheels. Your ministry is about to be empowered. That set of wheels was a 2022 Lamborghini that the rich man couldn't get. Can I tell him, Brian? You're not supposed to qualify. They're $50,000 over sticker. Over, am I, Brian, over sticker, 50,000. It wouldn't have mattered if it was 100,000. When God has an appointment, he's going to perform it. The look on some of your face, you're looking for a left hand and a right hand. I didn't see it, but I got it. Come on, because God said. That's what time it is, folks. If you're looking for it to make sense, it don't make sense. And now you done did this. I hope you know what you're doing. You done doubled up. Huh? You trying to say symbolically, you want my feet that beautiful? Well, your life just got double beautiful. Amen. You cannot. There was this. I waited, so 2009, look how long I had to wait, 13 years. God purposed that it would come in February. That was the month, Tariq, the reader, all that. That was February of 2004. And while that was going on, and they were filleting my name, God said, just hang on in there. I'm going to make sure that the blessing, and I'm going to make sure they are alive and in the city to see... The deal was done. Show your appointment. And I'm done because y'all blew. The deal was done January the 8th. January 8th. My bank wired a check, the whole thing, uh, on the 10th. The car didn't come because you couldn't register because of the registration between uh, 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 Massachusetts. The only place doesn't have temporary place. Had to go to a third party in Brooklyn, register. And I'm, man, I'm, man, where is my car? Then God had to come and say, look, you don't wait it this long. Nobody's holding up your car. I am. 
Ain't nobody holding up your car. It ain't that man and my salesman. I sent him a hot email. You know, I can talk. Email and whatever in the business. No, uh-uh. I'm holding up. Mm-mm. You waited this long. I have a certain day. To everything, there is a season and a time. I got a certain day. Because I don't want you forgetting the day that it lands. Remember I showed you? The frustration. So I go to DMV. I got this girl at DMV. She don't care what I get. I walk in there. She said, I know what you got coming. No hate, no nothing, just excited. She said, I'm the one who did the paperwork. She said, Boston sent the paperwork wrong. Remember, Boston, don't that ring? Didn't I sew into a Davion in Boston? Okay. That was a thousand dollar coat. Do you see the return on that? Oh, uh, y'all, okay, y'all, y'all slow in math. All right. Okay, all right. She said, I know what you got. I did a paper. She said, they sent it wrong. They didn't do the right, whatever. She said, I'm going to send it back. When I saw she had it, God, like, see, I got you. I got you. So they sent it back, whatever. Boo boo, where my car coming from? 30 inches of snow. God said, see, I don't want it here yet. In Boston. I don't want it here. I don't where my car at. It's been done, folks. Mm-hmm. Then on the tweet said, it's coming. Listen to this, and I'm done. So the man's on the way. Oh, my car is coming. I'm thinking it's coming on Saturday. No, huh? I'm thinking it's coming on, on Sunday. Uh, because I ain't hiding nothing. Hmm? Mm-hmm. I posted it because I take people's temperature. All right? Even in here. I'm not knowing y'all. I'm going to ping you out of here. Because you ain't ready for this. You ain't ready for the double. You sitting in the same row. Huh? You don't know what God going to do. So it starts with me. Matter of fact, whatever I get, you have access to. So, man, do your math then. That's why you can't have no broke down, pastor. Whether you get it or not, it's all a matter of your faith. But you got access to it. So the 21st, they said it's coming. Man, God, Brian and Cammy, come over to the house. I said, it's going to be here in evening time. They sit in my driveway. The man goes, he leaves the dispatcher. The man is 20 miles away. He's in Council Bluff. Where my car at? I don't care if it's midnight. He did not get the email, so he unplugged everything. Back then, truckers could go all day. They can't do it anymore. They, they're this thing that they, they determine their time. 20 miles out. I said, I'll come and get it. Uh-uh, man, so I've already, whatever. God's like, uh, you ain't going to get it. So we was out in the driveway, right? The next day, God said, uh uh-uh, uh, not on no 21st. I had a set day in mind so that you'll never forget. Double, double, double in the year of double, double. Double if you had any part of it. I don't care if it was four dollars. If you weren't ready for double, you shouldn't have did it. But you got double, 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 double. I need somebody to tell God, thank you. Don't have to see the left or the right arm. It's going to get down. Come on, members only. It should be a cheap jacket. Believers only. And you have no idea. <laughs> if somebody right, don't know the blessing they have on them. That's what's going on, folk. That's what's going on. I hope y'all can take it. I can take it. I hope y'all can take it. Because remember this. When you get next, they'll be talking about you. Trust and believe. 
I'm saying everything I can. I'm saying everything I can. And that's for these young men. I showed him because he the first child. He's the one with Brandy when she was in the car. That I want him to be a nerd. I want him to. I said, I'm showing you. What I'm showing you is not greater than what that mind can get. Huh? Everybody else. Even that young man back there paying attention. You ain't never seen that whip. Is that if it's a rapper or a ball player? That's a rapper, ball player, black youngster, NBA young boy, little dirt. No, it's a man of God. You ain't never seen nobody who didn't rap, play basketball. And it ain't no mega church blessing. It's a believer blessing, amen. On purpose. We are already looking for, I, my dealership already has the car Devin wants. If he follow the Jackson protocol. And one phone call away. Huh? I ain't hitch my wife. I already got my whip. I ain't hitch my wife. But if Devin is obedient. If Devin takes the baton and opens up the University of Oregon scholarship, don't matter your mama, amen, whoever. If Devin opens that up, we got a whole bunch of wealthy folk in here that don't look like it today, but they are. I need a worshiper to praise God for what they can see. If Cameron and Tasha listen, they'll be peeling out of those and thinking nothing and still be down to earth. Huh? All Lita did was get her mind right. And here come $50,000 check. Oh, and, and he ain't done. He ain't done. Somebody challenged her God and said, you didn't have a million without me. God said, well, let's see. To her face. And if this is too much for you, get off the train now. Get off the train now. If it's too much for you. This ain't no game, no gimmick. Are you ready for double? All right, you shouldn't have did it then. Double your income in your mind. Not an ending play, a starting point. Um, okay. Um. I wasn't going to tell y'all this, but I did. That's a prophecy. That's how we live. Okay. In a recession. Pandemic. Pandemics don't affect God's appointment. Okay. You got to know that's my word. What was going on in Genesis 26? Isaac. No, didn't stop nothing. That's why we come here seven in the morning. For word. I want to thank you. I'm going to rock it, y'all. Lord, y'all already know. Huh? Oh, yeah. I know what go with that, too. Yeah, no, no, I got that. It's easy. It's easy. Come on, bring your tithes off from y'all. Man, my goodness. Golly. Man, y'all really got. Golly. Oh, my goodness. You going to send it to me? Oh, send that to me. Mike, did you know about that? You little, you little. <laughs> hey, the man, the man, the man told her. Uh oh. You woke up to <laughs> give it up for this brilliant, beautiful child. <laughs> Woo, you were Jackson. And you know, 
so scary about her? You know what's so scary about her? How old are you? Nine. She got my taste buds at nine. <laughs> y'all think I'm playing. Y'all, y'all in trouble. If you a broke coach, this girl got A. No, she does. She knows what she wants. She knows what she wants. You know what? She's nine years old. Do you know what happens if you don't know what you want? You know how people treat you? When you don't know what you want? When you don't know who you are? She's nine and knows what she wants. A, 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 all this stuff is just immaculate. A, A, A. All right, y'all going to fool around. I'll give her the Crystal Simpson scholarship at nine years old. Come on, don't hate. Now, this is important. Daryl Carlisle told me. Yeah, man, you know how, hey. I said, next time you make over her. See, I handle stuff. I don't care what you give me. You know I'm going to handle my stuff, right? I don't know no other way. He said, I have to work on this because I, I didn't grow up being made over. Stay right here, Simone. Come here, baby. Because he need to see this. If the Jacksons can make over then you can make over. Amen, huh? It's not her fault that you weren't made over. Don't let no young man come in and say what you should have said. No young man going to be able to top what coach and the mo Either you can add to it or you won't be around. Because we have a standard of excellence here. Come on and thank God. Not stuff, not fashion, excellence. If you can be fashionable with excellence, God bless you. Thank you, baby. Now you can sashay off into the wilderness. Let us stand. My goodness. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Uh, now y'all don't want to stand. Look, I'm hungry. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up, Chris. Chris got him a couple of hundred dollars. He can't get up. <laughs> Two C notes. Did we miss anyone? Remember to pray for you, Leah. Excellent health report coming back. Sonia, Wednesday. Huh? Remember Raphael's in Italy? We know where Matt Lowry is. He got fired, but where's Raphael? He's Serbia, Italy. Amen. Have an excellent week. Come on, quit wasting these days. Quit wasting these days. Everybody turn and extend their right hand to Walter Ray. Touch his body. Touch his body. What the doctors can't find, God already knows. He's a miracle. He got his nurse. He'd have been gone a long time ago without that nurse. But he married his nurse. And he's alive because of who he married. His life is framed. His experience is a frame. He's a grandfather to the church. He has to stay. And finish his destiny. Touch his body. Replace pain with joy. 
In Jesus' name. Come on, believers. Put your hand together.